the expectation on us was too high. Hmm? People were expecting so much from us. And maybe after seven years, we haven't done to their expectation. Only God knows what is in somebody's mind. Or as a human being, you know, you cannot say that you are right or we have done what we should. So the government, they have really tried the administration. They have done their best, but maybe it's still not the best to others. To them, they have done their best. So only God knows. So we must apologize to, to Nigerians, you know, whether we have met up with the expectation or not. Mm. So what, in what areas do you think that they could have done better, maybe in your own opinion? I don't know, because my office, I run it like, like an NGO just to receive people. I, I'm not into government activities. My own is to support them either on health or education. I don't go into details of what they're doing. Do you think there's a chance that APC may not come back as the ruling party in Nigeria? Why did you ask that question? Of course, we'll continue. Of course, APC will win. Okay. By the grace of God. What do you want them to remember you the most for? Mm, service to humanity. Yes. We give some stationaries, school materials. And then during our campaign, we insist on, we, we extracted the like few points from the party manifesto that we capitalize on it and then we campaign on it that is feeding giving a hot meal to a primary school and secondary school students hot meal and that one will encourage them to remain in school and, uh, it was a big you know challenge for us because by the time we uh, my husband came into power there was no such resources you know for that but i insisted that we campaign for it and it must be done so are you going are you seeing this continuing after your husband leaves office yeah of course it will as long as it's an apc leadership and what if it's not it should be <laughs> do you see yourself going for any public office at all Mm, thank you very much. Uh, I thank God for giving me the opportunity to be the First Lady of Nigeria. And I think that position is such a priceless position. And I thank God and I pray to God that will grant us good exiting. We hand over to APC government again. And um, I don't have any political ambition because I'm, after that I'm going to be the former First Lady of Nigeria. What else am I looking for? What if you rest for some time and then you come back? I want to continue resting. <laughs> Short word of advice for the next uh, first ladies who are coming. What do you want them to know that probably nobody may tell them? Uh, let her just be herself. She should not allow anybody that will come and, you know, mortgage their administration. Okay. So they have to listen to people that voted for them or people that votes for them. They must listen to people and then be herself. Under any circumstance, she must be herself. She should not allow people to define her. She should, she should try and define herself.